Of course, a big night for Donald Trump, who just moments ago declared himself the party's presumptive nominee. A sweep of all five states with primaries today, and Trump talking from his campaign headquarters in New York City. This one's a diverse victory. I mean, you go Rhode Island, and you go Maryland, and you go Connecticut, and you go Pennsylvania, and you go, I mean, the whole thing, Delaware, and every one of them was conclusive, and every state is so different. I mean, it's so different. And Trump tweeting out just a short while ago a thank you to Rhode Island for his victory here. Of course, he was in Warwick yesterday campaigning, trying to drum up that support. And his supporters delivered for him tonight. The night team's Brian Crandall is live with some of them at the Trump party at Chapel Grill in Cranston. Brian? Yeah, Patrice and Dan, a few dozen Trump supporters gathered here, but they've long since cleared out. There wasn't a whole lot of suspense except for the margin of victory. Trump supporters watch the results come in as their man rolls to victory, pulling in a big slice of Rhode Island's Republican primary pie. State Rep Joe Trillo is Trump's honorary campaign chair for the state. I knew it was going to be big, but this is bigger than I ever thought it, it, it could. I mean, this is like the ultimate Christmas gift. Supporters I talk to are drawn to Trump's style. I truly believe he, that he really loves the America and that he wants to bring our country back. I think he's very honest and I think and that's what I like about him. But critics claim he goes too far. This guy takes a pancake and he's shoving it in his mouth. He's like, it's disgusting. That was Trump at his rally in Warwick Monday. But after attending the rally yesterday, a lot of what he says, he says it kind of tongue in cheek, like he's making fun of this guy, eating too much or taking too big on. Yeah, but even so, a lot of people think that's not really presidential. That's just somebody uh, making fun you of You know somebody. what? What is presidential today? And indeed, Donald Trump has turned a lot of conventional wisdom on its head. Live in Cranston, Brian Crandall, NBC 10 News Night Team.